Hey guys, Reverend Up Seven here. Today I'm going to be showing you guys uh, some stuff I got today at Toys R Us. Um, this is probably going to be the last time, it's crazy to say, but the last time we'll ever go there for Hot Wheels. Um, what was I going to say? We picked up some cars today, and no, nothing crazy, but they had a 40% off deal on Hot Wheels. So these guys were 60 cents, and same thing on Matchbox. Oops, same thing with Matchbox. So you picked up one of these really cool Globe Travelers cars, cars that I've been seeing for a long time. And I thought I'd show you guys this stuff. So starting off, we got this prayer, what's it called? Futurismo. This is new for 20, not new for 2018. It's a 2017 or 16 car, I think. I'm not sure, but I think it looks cool in this green and yellow paint scheme with the, uh, I'm not sure what those wheels are called, but they're the razor blade wheels, I guess. The new razor blade wheels. Um, this is going to be a really good track car we're going to use for videos in the future. So, I figured since they didn't have any treasure hunts or anything, I'd just pick up some good track cars for the future. The car lies pretty low, or hangs, I don't know what the term is. It's pretty, it's, hangs, hangs not the right word. It is low to the ground. It sits low to the ground, that's the word. But, uh, I think it'll still be a really good track car. It doesn't really have a front splitter. It looks like it does here, but it doesn't. It's uh, pretty, got a low center of gravity, even though it's a metal-based car, metal uh, body car, plastic base. I just think it'd be a good track car to have. Futurismo, pretty cool. Number 89. I also got this um, track hammer car, which I'm actually gonna end up either returning or, um, I don't think you can return stuff at Toys R Us anymore. I might do some sort of trade-in or, I don't know, because it, it just, something about this car, I should have noticed. It looks like it's already been re-glued. It's got a hole up here in the packaging. Focus. You can, I don't know if you can see that. The back wheel's got some crap on it. It looks bent. I don't know if this is a return, a re-glue, or just been handled pretty bad, but, yeah, it's just not the greatest car. So I'm going to leave this in the box until I find out what's the deal with this thing. Um... And you already saw this. this is a Globe Travelers Audi R8. Um, I'm gonna open this guy up. I don't usually collect Matchbox, but I've, I'm really liking these this new series they're doing. Some really sick looking stuff. I was looking for the Porsche 911 in orange, the GT2 or GT3, and I couldn't find that there. It comes with a little Matchbox box. <laughs> Beautiful car. It's got rubber tires on it um awesome matte green and white paint job it's a lot of detail on it uh has some racing liveries and uh license plate headlight detail taillight detail it's just a really nice really nice car beautiful Our, the audi r8 is one of the most underrated looking supercars out there and this is the older generation, and I think it's actually hard to tell the difference between the new generation and this older generation, because it looks so good. And this car was designed in 2003, and it looks like it looked like this in 2003. That's insane, but really nice car. Rolls pretty well. Surprise! There's a lot of play in the wheels. There are rubber tires. A lot of play in the axle. Which makes it not smooth ride as good as it could, but it still rides really nice. Yeah, that's that. So, uh, thanks for watching. Subscribe for more Hot Wheels videos. We're actually working on a track video right now. We got the track built. We're going to start filming. I pick up some cars today at Toys R Us, including this guy right here, to film uh, that video. So, when that video drops, probably this weekend, um, we'll be ready with this car to drive, drive the track. Um, what else is going on? We're going to New York for our usual month-long trip. Where we're going to get a ton of cars, hopefully finish the Velocity X collection. A lot of flea market find videos are coming in the future. And, uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Subscribe for more videos. Bye.